All right, we're here at Iowa Speedway with Carlin Racing driver Max Chilton. Max, you hadn't even run on an oval until testing. Now you're P1 here at Iowa. You're feeling yourself getting more and more uncomfortable every week. Yeah, it's uh, it's been a you know it's been difficult uh, for any European driver to come over. It's very alien-like, um, and I haven't felt very confident on the ovals at all this year. And I've only done one race, but um, I rocked up here missing testing, and I felt good for the first five laps. So I knew if the team, you know, gave me the car, which they always do, and I kept my foot flat, um, we'd get the job done. And it was, you know, Ed's been struggling as well, but he he got pole, um, and then I managed to take off him. So I knew I had a good chance, and I just got the job done. Now back in May when we were running at Indy. Throughout the month of May, tire wear was critical. Are you guys worried about the rubber today? Um, it's an unknown, so I think everyone's slightly cautious. I think from what we've been given on the uh, tire data, we're looking pretty good compared to the others. Um, but as I say, it's a long race. There's 100 laps. We'll just have to uh, play it by ear. I know for much of the racing world, carrying on with heavy hearts this weekend because of Jules, you or his teammates, their extra emotion for you this weekend? Yeah, 100%. He, um, I know if he was there today, he would have... Um, he would have been on pole as well, so it's um, you know it's a it's a big loss for the for the world. Um, he was a top guy, quick driver, and I, I've learned a lot from him. He's um, he was he, there was a lot of um, lot of talent he had, and he was I'm sure destined to be a world champion.